<laughs> very tough killer. He, he's he's going to win his fair share of them. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we go back and forth this year. Oh, wait, stop. He's a comedian. Stop working. Um, <laughs> but no, he had a great car. I knew it was going to be the guy we had to beat. Um, they were tested up here last week. Everybody said they were real quick. They showed it all weekend that they were real quick and just they were a tick uh, tick off on their pit stop and we were just a tick better and that's all it took. Uh, the competition so close you can guys, you guys can see it and just drove my butt off and uh, was able to get it done. Seems like the third time was a charm. You had two shots to get the lead, once under Leah, once under Woody, caution flag comes out. Yeah, that's, uh, if you look at any of the crew wins I ever have, there's a million cautions in that race and they're always at the worst times for us, but uh, just try to keep my cool. I knew it was a little bit better, just didn't want to uh, be the guy that messed it up for my guys. Justin, you said over the radio afterwards, thank you guys for holding on to me and continuing to believe in me. Were you thinking near the end of last year that there could have been a chance that you were leaving the team? <laughs> you never know on this tour. It's uh, it's tough, you know, there's a lot of guys jump around every year and, you know, at some point maybe people want to look elsewhere, you know, it's been one driver, one team for a while, so uh, things weren't going the way I would like to see. Um, we made some adjustments within our team. Spaff goes, Robert Yates, new crew chief. Um, and it's right out of the box pretty good, so hopefully we can continue this. Uh, been on a little bit of a hot streak since uh, New Smyrna. Hopefully we can just ride this for a while. There's been a lot of talk about Kobe Priest, Priest Kobe, championship, championship. Is this a statement maker that, you know what, there's other guys here? Oh, yeah, I mean, I mean, those guys will probably even tell you the same thing. There's there's 10 to 12 guys that could win every week. Just, uh, you know, they had great equipment, great, great racing luck. You know, sometimes things just don't go your way on the day they should. And, uh, I mean, Woody proved it today. You get in a, a top-notch car, and look at that. I mean, career day for him. Uh, it's not about just those two guys. They get a lot of attention, but hey, it's well deserved too when you go win back-to-back -back championships and as many races as they've won over the years. It's it's well earned too. I mean, they both look at Doug. Doug's fought for rides forever, and now he's in great equipment and he very much deserves so. So same with Ryan. He bounced around a little bit too.